I walk, I step right in between all of them, pick them up, brush the snow off of them, handcuff them, put them in the back seat of my car, and cut the, you know, I cut the heat on, and I transport them to the station. And it's funny because he wasn't, the suspect was mad. You just kind of got the feeling from him that, you know, this just business. Like, this is how it's supposed to be. And I never experienced that until then. And I'm like, this is not how it's supposed to be. Scott can't really get over what he saw. At that moment, it that made me question what's really going on here. It, it, it made me like, is this, something, is this something I really want to be a part of? He keeps thinking about that. In that moment, it made me rethink it, but actually that had to make my resolve greater because it showed me it's like we need more like me and less like that. In the big picture, I need to stay. continues to work in patrol for a number of years and then he moves on to this special squad where he's investigating drugs and gangs on the streets of Flint. In 2006, 